Gentlemen, please direct your attention to the field as we honor the Iowa State Athletics Hall of Fame Class of 2016. Our first inductee is one of the greatest gymnasts in Iowa State history. He was a two-time national champion and two-time All-American as one of the NCAA's finest performers on the still rings from 1984 to 1986. He won two Big 8 titles and was named Iowa State's Male Athlete of the Year in 1986. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer Mark Diab. Our next inductee was a trendsetter in Iowa State's storied wrestling program as the first Cyclone to win a national title and first ISU wrestler to compete in the Olympic Games. He was first three-time conference champion in school history, claiming titles from 1927 to 1929, a national AAU champion in 1928. He was a member of Iowa State's first conference championship wrestling squad in 1929. Represented by his grandson, Ken Holding, please join us in honoring Iowa State Hall of Famer, Arthur Holding. Our next inductee was responsible for resurrecting the Iowa State football program during his tenure from 1995 to 2006. As the winningest football coach in ISU history with 56 wins, he energized an entire fan base by leading the Cyclones to five bowl games from 2000 to 2005. His 2000 squad tied the school record with nine wins and won the school's first ever bowl game with a victory at the Insight.com Bowl. This leader, who was named Big 12 Coach of the Year in 2004, also jump-started the dormant rivalry between Iowa State and Iowa by defeating the intrastate rival Iowa five straight times from 1998 to 2002. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer Dan McCartney. Our next inductee set numerous school records and played an important role in establishing the rich tradition of women's hoops at Iowa State. A four-time All Big 12 selection and honorable mention All-American in 2000, she ended her career owning school records in six categories. Her impact on the team was instant, leading the Cyclones to four NCAA tournament appearances and three Big 12 titles, two postseasons and one regular season. She started all 132 games of her Cyclone career, winning 104 of them. The 2001 Iowa State Female Athlete of the Year has her number 51 German jersey permanently retired and hung in the rafters of Hilton Coliseum. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer, Megan Taylor. Our next inductee is considered the greatest point guard in Iowa State's men's basketball history, dazzling fans with his uncanny ball handling and passing skills. This first team All-American and 2001 Big 12 Player of the Year set records and racked up countless postseason awards in his incredible Cyclone career. But it was his winning mentality in which most Cyclones remember him for. In his two years as a Cyclone, ISU won back-to-back -back Big 12 regular season titles in 2000 and 2001 and advanced to the Elite Eight of the 2000 NCAA Tournament. Winning was in his DNA, posting a 57-11 overall record and never losing a game in Hilton Coliseum, telling a 34-0 mark to help elevate Hilton Magic into a national brand. The 2001 Iowa State Male Athlete of the Year later became a first-round NBA draft pick, completing 11 seasons as a professional in the NBA. Please, please join us in honoring Iowa State Hall of Famer Jamal Tinsley. Our next inductee was a member of Iowa State's Juggernaut Wrestling Program from 1966 to 1968, helping the team finish in the top three at the NCAA Championship all three of his seasons on the mat. His outstanding grap this outstanding grappler won a Midlands title in 1967 and capped off his outstanding cyclone career by winning the NCAA individual crown at 160 pounds as a senior in 1968. 
His time at Iowa State prepared him for a successful coaching career where he compiled a 173, 60, and 5 record and mentored six All-Americans as head coach of the United States Naval Academy from 1988 to 2000. He's a member of the Iowa Wrestling Hall of Fame and the Iowa High School Wrestling Hall of Fame. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer, Reg Wicks. Our next inductee left her mark as one of the most decorated softball players in Iowa State history. A three-time All Big 12 selection, she was a first-team All-Region pick in 1999 when she led the team in batting, hits, RBIs, and home runs. After her stellar Cyclone career ended, she continued her success internationally when she competed in two Olympic Games for Canada in 2000 and 2004. In 2005, Iowa State cemented her legacy by retiring her number two jersey, the first and only Cyclone softball player to be bestowed that honor. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer Aaron Woods. Our final inductee was an outstanding distance runner on Iowa State's powerhouse men's track and field and cross-country teams from 1984 to 87. This track star won nine conference titles and earned All-American honors five times in his career, helping the Cyclones win seven Big 18 championships along the way. The school record holder in the indoor 3,000 meter, he was named the most outstanding athlete at the Big 8 Indoor Championships in 1985 and 1986. Please welcome back Iowa State Hall of Famer, Raf Wins. Ladies and gentlemen, your 2016 Iowa State Letter Winners Club Hall of Famers.